Uh, our, our team is a solar powered LED nightlight. Our sponsor is Dr. Colbus. Um, right here, we, basically, we used a. We're trying to make the most efficient design possible. You know, it, comparing to this commercial nightlight, you know, sidewalk nightlight you'd find in a yard or anywhere else. And we had four other designs here. This first design here, the process, we uh, just tried to make a real simplistic circuit. And we actually had to step out of bounds of minimizing our types of battery and the voltage that we was driving the circuit. But it actually, it's pretty efficient for what it, what it is. And the sensor set here, it turns this thing on and off. And the solar cell here charges it in the daytime. The second design here, the dial on the top there, you have to get bright light or infrared light on it to turn it off. And it charges during the day. And the same thing with this one here. And, uh, let's see. Hey, what else did you want? Okay, right here on the board here. All right, essentially, why this project was important is really alternative uh, energy sources. You know, and LEDs are efficient, solid state technology, and they run at low voltage or safe and low cost. And we we're trying to maximize efficiency in this project and be fully charged in four hours sunlight, which they, they can be, and they run for at least eight hours. Many of these actually run for several days before they're out of power. And they use white LED and solar cells mounted on top. The cost here is just off the shelf what we paid. And the commercial one was nine dollars for the unit. And the rest of them incorporated the uh, the shell, you know, for the exterior, which is included in this price here. But this third design here was the most complicated, and it's also the most expensive one, forty-five dollars for that unit. And uh, these are pictures just showing the night and daytime operation. And this is a basic design process here. We have the energy coming from the solar cell, energy storage, power conversion, and then driving the LED. And right here is our four designs. A simple resistor circuit, a blocking oscillator circuit, internally switch butt boost, externally switch butt boost, and a just this is a boost converter in the, in the, in the commercial uh, unit. And down here is our relative efficiencies in comparison between all the units during daytime and nighttime operation. That's it right there on the design process.